in the Nigel Mansell to take us for a fast lap of the new circuit. Warming the tyres up now, going around the left-hander towards uh, Luffield Corner, and then uh, round here now to Woodcut, and now accelerating as hard as one can, a little bit of wheel spin opposite lock, second, third, fourth, fifth, sixth gear across the start and finish line, trying to leave your braking as late as possible for cops now, braking at 100 metre board, round the corner, flat in fifth, accelerating through, leaving every bit of the circuit, sixth, into this complex of corners at Beckett's now, fifth, bit of oversteer, down to fourth, accelerating through as fast as you can. Now you're losing the picture because of the lateral G load here, you're snapping 9G, down onto hangar straight into sixth gear, approaching 190 miles an hour now, and into the new stow corner. Down to fifth, down to fourth, trying to hold it tight, accelerating all the way, sliding out, fighting the car a little bit, into fifth, braking hard here now, fourth, third, second, car a little bit in the way, second, third, round club, the new club, the G-Force round here now, look at the helmet, third, fourth, fifth, sixth, coming up round Abbey Curve, very fast now in sixth, up to the Foster's Bridge, a little bit of a lift and flat in sixth gear, into the new complex, braking very hard down to third gear, a lot of opposite lock, keeping on the power, fighting the car, coming again into Luffield Corner, a lot of slide, a lot of opposite lock, third gear, down to second gear, now through woodcut again, accelerating across the grass just a little bit, third, fourth, fifth, in sixth gear, start and finish line. One minute, 22.64 seconds was Nigel's lap time on Friday, but his fans knew he'd have to go faster still on Saturday. And so did Nigel as he talked things over with Williams designer Patrick Head. At least a second quicker had to be their target.